Established in 1984 in Australia, Cash Converters has grown to become the world's largest cash and asset converter with over 700 stores globally. And the best people to hear more about the business from are the people who were in the same position you are now, our franchisees. I'm Lerato Sibagnoni. My store is in Greenstone. My background, I was previously a financial consultant and I came into Cash Converters about nine years ago. We started in 2000. It's Ryan, my son, and I'm Peter. After university, Ryan went overseas for a bit. He was a bit of a muser, played in a band and things, and eventually came back and he joined me, and we've been a great father and son team since then. My name's Rukshana. I'm in partnership with Lynn Godfrey at Cash Converters Capegate. I'm the owner of the Hill Fox store in the West Strand. Uh, been there now for five years. I did look at other businesses in the second hand uh, trade and I also looked at uh, the food industry but uh, very little really interested me. I was in the fast food industry. Apart from being bored with that, nothing changes there. It's the same thing and I don't think the returns were worth it. I've always been a, a person that going to auctions and buying things and selling things. So it was just part of me. The stock was interesting, the people were interesting. No days the same as the day before. It's just fascinating. For me, it's totally different. You don't know what to expect any given day. You don't know what stock comes through your door and you meet people from various walks of life. So, and you build up customer relationships as well. We've been thriving. Um, I think we've been doing very well. What you would find is maybe the will be more people that need to sell goods in tough economic times, but there's also healthy spending when economic times are up. For someone like me, who was uh, in consulting on the financial side, I knew nothing of business, so there was no way I was going to be able to run a store. Their training was very important, uh, the guidelines and, and bringing you into it. Uh, suddenly your own business, suddenly your own responsibility. The losses are your losses. <laughs> so without the support I got and training, I don't think I would have been able to do it. It's not an easy business. It's hard work. It's retail and it's buying and it's selling and it's, it's not an easy job, but it's, it is rewarding. Our model is buy it and sell it, move it on. When, when, when you think about pawn shops or whatever, you see this little cluttered store. Cash converters, nothing like that. It's high quality second hand goods. Very well merchandised. Uh, we get a lot of compliments, people thinking this, this stuff is new, which is not, it's just been properly taken care of. Each store has got its own character. You have your second hand AMC pots, you have your sound equipment, you have your camera equipment, you have your hi-fi equipment, your games, endless discs. If you take, even when Ryan came back, we weren't really into the guitars and things like that. But suddenly we had somebody with a passion for guitars and musical instruments, etc. And this built up that part, side of the business. Most things are your general DVD player, um, jewellery item, uh, video camera or whatnot. But here and there you see very interesting things. I guess that's what we all love about it. Each store is kind of different. You don't have, you know, you don't see exactly the same goods in each store. It kind of gives you the opportunity to be yourself. We also do what we call the cash advance. Someone can literally walk in and within five minutes walk out with 500 or 1,000 rand and we'll, we'll borrow him, uh, instant money against any item of value. We give you money, we hold your goods for 30 days. You have 30 days to come back and get them. If they have a problem, they can't get back in 30 days, we extend it, we try to help them, we have empathy. And that's the difference with our business. The other way is to get a loan against your salary. That's what we call the payday advance uh, product. I would say for you to buy into a cash converter, yes, you're going to make money. You're going to have lots of fun. You're going to meet various people from all walks of life. Money is there to be made. <coughs> Stock is there. Just, just follow the guidelines. Just follow what you're supposed to do, and you won't go wrong. Bored? No, not a chance. <laughs> There's no ways. I just enjoy what I'm doing. So, isn't that great? 
make money and enjoy what you're doing. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> if you want to invest money, you want to invest it to get a decent return. And show me another franchise where you get a better return. To me, it's as simple as that.